Let me fix these landing gears. It's canted to the left, or yeah, angled so to the left. Flat? No, you can, you can tell that they're, they're turned out. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not mounted. Yeah. Alright, this is the Hyperion Project. We are uh, collaborating with the University of Sydney, Australia, and University of uh, Stuttgart, Germany. It's a design project to design, build, and fly uh, the Hyperion aircraft in nine months. And uh, we're looking to do some flight testing in the next uh, next week. The, the prop adapter shaft I made is not balanced correctly, so it, it, um, it wobbles. Right it's super clutch. Okay. It's going to be It's like these. Okay. So some of the challenges we had to overcome was uh, primarily learning how to use composite materials. The entire aircraft is made out of uh, fiberglass with a carbon fiber internal structure. Um, many of us on the team had very little experience with uh, composite manufacturing. Pulling that off in a time frame along with delocalized manufacturing. Uh, here at the University of Colorado, we built the, the wings and had to interface with the center body and internal structure which was manufactured in Germany by our University of Stuttgart team. Um, we had wind tunnel testing being performed by the University of Sydney, Australia, and we collaborated those results or compared those results with the University of Germany's CFD results um, to pull off a very unique and uh, beautiful aircraft design that we're looking to do flight testing in the next month.